Hi everyone, Justin Jackrell here from Vitelli Carts. We've had a lot of requests recently to do a video on our XB rental go-kart, so I want to go ahead and show you the different specifications that come on this cart, as well as the different features that come standard. This model right here is actually one of our best sellers out of our entire fleet. It's great for all rental applications, and the majority of our customers are actually worldwide and outside of the United States, so we wanted to go ahead and make a video for those of you that don't have the opportunity to fly in and test it firsthand to be able to really see what this go-kart can do. Be a great addition to your fleet. We'll go ahead and go from front to back on this go kart, show you the different features, and then what we'll do is we'll do a test drive around the property. We're here in Gainesville, Florida. We look forward to talking to you soon. Visit us online at bentellicarts.com. All right, so in the front of the go kart, I first want to show you the shock absorbers. This is actually a new system that we redesigned in 2013. So, all around the go kart, you're going to see all of these D shaped shock absorbers. These are actually there to obviously protect the go kart. So, if this go kart takes a really hard impact, that's going to take most of that shock, so your frame is going to take the damage. Now, these are easily replaceable, so if you do get into a large accident, it only uh, takes two bolts, and you go ahead and, and replace that and put a new one on there. Additionally, we replaced the and upgraded the perimeter bumper system on here. We used to actually use a steel system, and now we're actually using this molded plastic. Really, really strong and has done great in our testing and, and showing really long life of uh, the bumper system and shock absorbers. Now, going to the pedals, I first want to show you that obviously they're painted red and green. This is for safety standards, and many countries on their international safety requirements actually mandate that you have the pedals painted red and green for the drivers. You will see here in the middle, this is the master cylinder for the brake system. Attached to the master cylinder is actually a setup that will make it where the passengers cannot be riding on the gas and the brake at the same time. This is actually really important, so obviously your brake pads aren't being worn out prematurely. Then finally here, the center fuel tank, you're going to see is between the legs of the passengers. Uh, a lot of customers ask us why it goes in between your legs. That's actually a safety standard. Uh, most insurance companies do not want a fuel tank up near the head of the passenger, just because if, you know, worst case scenario, the go-kart were to ever flip over, you don't want fuel being that close to your head. That being said, this go-kart is so low to the ground and has such a wide center of gravity, it's virtually impossible to flip it. So really not an issue at all, just as there between your legs to meet the safety standards of the different insurance companies. So what we're going to do now is we'll go towards the other side of the go-kart. I'll show you the rear axle components, the cover, and the motor. Okay, so first off on the side here, you're going to see that you have additional shock absorbers, which is going to protect the car from any side impacts. Uh, I also want to mention on our frames, we use a three millimeter wall chrome molly frame. The one thing you want to be careful of is a lot of the lower priced competitors out there are using a mild steel frame, and realistically, those don't really last very long, a couple months, and they're going to start cracking. With the type of go kart like this where it's going to be hit a lot, you want to make sure you have the best quality steel as possible uh, for that frame. So we use a great chrome molly frame on there. Now, on our single seater go karts in 2013, we have two different models. We've got our six and a half horsepower and our nine horsepower. This model right here is our nine horsepower. It's going to go up to about 55 miles an hour. Obviously, you can govern it down if you want it to go slower. The six and a half horsepower version is going to go about 30 to 35 miles an hour. Now, on the nine horsepower, it comes with electric start and pull start. With our six and a half horsepower, you're just going to get that pull start. The, the electric start is really nice. It's a real added convenience because all you have to do is twist this key and it's going to start right up for you. Obviously, the 6.5 horsepower won't have that feature, but it is very easy to start with the pull start as well. Usually, in the first one or two pulls, it's going to start right up for you. You've got your choke over here on your air filter, and that's going to allow you in the, in the mornings for that first run to start it up a little bit easier. You're also going to see here that we've got an engine cover here. This is a molded plastic. This is a safety feature so the driver doesn't burn themselves on the motor. And you are going to see that above the seat over here, we actually have a headrest as well, which is obviously for better protection. We use a double XL seat, which is good for pretty much all adults. On the back of the go-kart, you're going to see that there's a rear cover. That obviously is going to protect the driver from having any loose objects or long hair going into the axle, which is a safety feature. So all these things come standard, as you see here on the cart. None of this is an additional accessory. We don't charge any extra for anything that you see here. The uh, last thing is the molded uh, covered steering wheel right here. It's got a nice uh, you know, covering, which is a leather type, which makes it a real comfortable and makes it where even on those longer races, your hands aren't getting worn out on some of the, like on some of the steel uh, steering wheels that are out there with some of our competitors. 
So what we're going to do now is we're going to get one of our employees here to strap on our helmet cam and he's going to take you on a ride to really show you what it looks like from the driver perspective and then what we'll do is we'll come back here, I'll wrap up this video and then if you have any other questions feel free to contact us. All right, so that's going to do it for me today. This was our 2013 nine horsepower rental cart. Remember, we do have models that are both the racing and rental side in single and dual seater configurations. We also have children's size carts if needed. We do ship worldwide and offer quantity discounts for buying more than one cart. So please feel free to give us a call and we can help you out get a quote that will suit your needs. My name is Justin Jackrell from Bentelli Carts. I look forward to speaking with you soon. Thank you for watching.